23 years old, black, female, 1915. She solved what the entire medical world couldn't crack, made the first effective treatment for one of history's most feared diseases, and a man with a doctorate from Yale stole everything. Alice Ball didn't just break barriers at the University of Hawaii. First woman, first African-American, masters in chemistry. By 23, she'd already been published in the Journal of the American Chemical Society. Then doctors handed her the impossible. Leprosy, patients were being shipped to, to Molokai Island to die. The only treatment? Shalmugra oil so thick it created abscesses under the skin. Ball isolated the active compounds, made them injectable, soluble, actually worked. The Ball method freed 78 patients from quarantine in just three years. But Ball died at 24 before she could publish. And Arthur Dean, the university president, took her research, published it, called it the Dean method. His name, his glory. For decades, until 1922, when Dr. Harry Hallman published the truth, said Dean's so-called improvements were worthless, that Ball's original method was genius. But it took until the year 2000, 84 years, for Hawaii to finally put her name on a plaque. Alice Augusta Ball didn't just change medicine. She proved brilliance has no color, no gender, no age limit. If this story gave you chills, smash that like button, share it, subscribe for more buried history that needs to be told. Because legends like Alice Ball deserve to be remembered.